Before we get this video started, special shout outs to Jumpman Lou, Jonathan DeBot, Jonas Probst, Slimy Water, The Professor 08, and No Chill Knowles. If you want a shout out in my next video, all you have to do is watch this video, and at some point I'm going to tell you some word or phrase to comment, and if you do this, I'm going to be picking five of you guys at random to shout out at the beginning of my next video. Now you guys enjoy. Now this is a video that I probably could have made sooner, because I've actually had Pink Diamond McAdoo in my lineup for a little over a week now, but nonetheless, we're going to be getting a game plan with him today. 6'9", center and power forward, and I know that's a bit undersized for a big man, but everything around the rim is a 95 or up, 96 mid-range shot, the playmaking is great for a big man, great defense in the paint, and the rebounding is almost perfect. And look at the athleticism, pretty good speed and acceleration, 93 vertical and 92 strength. So all the attributes are pretty great. Six Hall of Fame badges, contact finisher and worm, rebound chaser and box, and 20 gold badges. He can protect the rim, he can finish, he can basically do everything except shoot threes, so this is going to be pretty interesting. I don't think I've seen any of these guys online before. Kobe, Paul Pierce, Diamond, Chris Webber, and Matumbo. It's going to be interesting seeing how McAdoo matches up with Webber and Matumbo. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, leave a like on this video, and show some love in the comments. Now let's get right to it. That Diamond, Chris Webber should be pretty good, right? because you have to have all those players and do all those challenges to unlock them. Let's see if McAdoo can outplay him though. It looks like McAdoo's going right down to the post, so we're going to immediately go at him. We're going to hit him with a nice spin. Oh, and that's an easy layup. If we can score that easily, McAdoo's going to have a huge game. He's jumping like crazy. Look at this. Let's just get the ball right back down to McAdoo in the post. Again, I don't think Weber can stop him. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that was going to be a dunk. I was trying to pump fake and get him in the air. Wow, great defense in the paint. Nobody was even close to him. Playing bad defense in the first quarter is a tradition for me. Let's just keep on feeding McAdoo the ball. He's in the post, the lane's open, and I'm spinning again. Oh yeah! Whoa! He threw it down right over Kobe! I didn't think he was going to shoot that. That's why I didn't jump. I didn't think he'd actually shoot that layup over Artis. But either way, y'all know the drill. We're feeding the ball to McAdoo again, and he's not playing help. I don't know why he's not playing help. It's literally a guaranteed score every time in the post. Look at that. Easy finger roll, and there was basically no contest. Once again, I'm in the paint, but I just can't get a contest. I don't get how, but sometimes my interior defense is so crap. Oh, and Chris Webber's hugging McAdoo. I gotta send him back door. If you see somebody playing defense that close, Send your man to the rim. I think he's got Kawhi in there to try and stop McAdoo, but if I'm being honest, I just don't think he'll be able to. I know Kawhi's a great defender, but McAdoo is just too much of a beast in the paint. He has 99 strength. I mean, look at this. Look how easily he pushed him. He's literally an unstoppable scorer in the paint. Crap. How am I not blocking that? He literally can't miss a shot around the rim. To be fair, though, we can't miss a shot around the rim either. McAdoo's getting there every time, and he's finishing. Nice spin! Ooh! He gets there every single time. I'm ready if he goes up. And of course he's making that too. He literally can't miss a layup. I know I haven't played the best defense, but some of these have to miss. Okay, McAdoo. Let's bully Kawhi again. He selected Matumbo, but I have the moves. I got him in the air! Another slam! Every time he gets to the paint, he shoots it. Oh, great D. Ooh! Wow. Everything he throws up is going in. We got to get it right back. Oh, nice adjustment. McAdoo scored our first 18 points. At least he's on fire. That's deep. I might actually have to guard that. For now, though, we got the stop, and we're back on the fast break. I see McAdoo running down the middle, and I got to give it to him. 20 points for McAdoo in the first quarter. If we can stop penetration, we're going to be all right. That was good defense. We just got to stop him from getting all the way to the rim. McAdoo got the rebound, and he's running the floor so fast. Even though he got the rebound, he's the first one to the rim. This man is a beast. Let's play better defense this quarter. 17 points. Oh, nice block by Gilmore. 
and immediately we block a shot. We get the board. McAdoo has the ball. Ooh, of course he had to block me in return. Right by the rim though. So that's an easy put back. Two more points. So now he has Kevin Garnett in the game to try and guard McAdoo. And that Amethyst Kevin Garnett's not bad, but I just don't think he's fast enough to stay in front of McAdoo. I'm blowing right past him. Ooh, that was a clean 360. Ooh, I shouldn't have jumped. Oh, another block. We're doing a much better job protecting the rim this quarter. Now where's McAdoo? Oh, he's going baseline. Lay up. Ooh, nice board. I'm going back up. And this should be two easy points. I love his free throw. Ah, crap. He actually did a really good job moving it around the zone right there. Let's just get those points right back. Let's keep on feeding McAdoo while he has his takeover. Now, how is he going to guard me? Oh, he's sitting back. He's giving me a runway. Ooh! He just left the red carpet wide open for me. Now, that's a good stop. A couple more scores, and we can go up by double digits. And we're basically scoring the ball every single time we come down the floor. Nobody can stop McAdoo, especially with TakeOver. Oh, man! Weber can't do anything about him. I don't have any big man in the paint. God, now he's putting on a show. He's throwing lobs on our home court. We got to get those two points back, and it has to be fancy. Chris Weber is hugging McAdoo again. McAdoo just can't stop dunking the ball. I've lost count of how many dunks he has. If we can get just a few stops on defense, we're going to be all right. This game is still kind of close. We have a decent cushion, I guess. Oh, it's lagging. Crap. That actually worked out for me pretty well. I got to the rim really easily, even though it's lagging. I don't know what's up with the servers. I actually have to throw that pass. I didn't want to, but it's a six-point game. Now we're up by eight. And he's double teaming McAdoo, so I might actually have to pass the ball to other people. Ooh. Bad release, though. McAdoo with the rebound. And we're back on the fast break again. Y'all know McAdoo loves to run the floor. And here he comes right down the middle! We're about to hit 40 and a half. I think he shoots this. Oh, I was right. Great defense by Powell. And now we have the last shot of the quarter. But I'm not waiting for the last shot. I'm going to McAdoo. Oh. He actually blocked my shot. We're still open in the paint, though. Easy layup. 41 points in the first half. This is Jason Williams' debut with the team. So let's see how he helps us on offense. In a real game, I would have shot that three, but McAdoo's open. He can't shoot, so I'm taking it to the rim. Oh, how'd he miss that layup? And one! It's about time we got our first and one with McAdoo. Oh, he got me. I thought he was going to pass that ball. I still somehow got a decent contest on that shot. I have no idea how. McAdoo's running down the middle. I got to lob it up. Oh! The reverse alley-oop off a perfect pass. I can chase this down. Oh, how would I not block that? I thought I ran in and timed it perfectly to get the block. Man, that would have been nice. Oh, he's double teaming. I'll just lob it up to McAdoo again. It's not a dunk. But we still get the two points. That was still nice. This is a big possession. We have 48 points with Bob McAdoo. Right here, we have the chance to hit 50 points with three minutes left in the third quarter. Okay, so he's not playing help. Oh, I got him in the air. And one! 50 points with McAdoo. Right here, we can make a 51 on our home floor. I still have to watch out because this game isn't over just yet. If I let him get hot from three, he could come back in a matter of like one or two minutes. The lane's open again though. Oh man. McAdoo with a beautiful finger roll. I gotta stop leaving him open. He did miss it though. That's the second wide open three he's missed with Paul Pierce. McAdoo's running. I gotta lob it up. Whoa! I thought that pass was way too high. Wow. I thought it was going to sail right out of bounds. We're pretty close to hitting 60 points. I'm pretty sure that we can do that by the end of this quarter. We have a minute 42. All we need is five points. And McAdoo's really been lighting it up this entire game. He has an open lane to the rim. Ah, oh, man. Oh, he still made it. That was actually a good contest. Crap. Okay. 
See, this is what I was talking about earlier. We were just up by what, 17? And now he's back within nine. The lane is open though, so that's an easy two points with McAdoo. We got those two points right back, but he's gotten hot from deep and I'm not back on D. Oh my God, he is lighting me up. And he's putting me in a position where if I don't score every single time down the court, he's just gonna keep on cutting into the lead. So I'm not even gonna try to score with McAdoo here. I'm just gonna try to score with whoever I can. Jason Williams is wide open. I'm just gonna shoot it with him. We're back up by double digits, but like, he's still knocking on my door. I'm still kind of nervous because I have to stop Paul Pierce. He just can't miss. Okay, there's no way. Very late. Come on! Very late from that deep? I'm sorry, that's not supposed to be going in. Okay, he's hugging McAdoo again. This is for 60. 61 points. Let's close out this game. Okay, so we can go back up by double digits right here. And really, if I just play smart man-to-man -man defense, we should be able to close out this game. I don't want to waste this 60-point performance from McAdoo. He's been playing so well. Oh, why is he jumping? Oh, Matumbo! Whoa! He was able to finish over Matumbo. Okay. Okay, I'm right in his face this time. Now, that's good defense. If I can just stay with him and contest his shots, he's not going to be hitting the same BS he was hitting in that quarter. Let's keep on scoring with McAdoo. We're going right back down to the post. And Matumbo cannot guard him. Oh, yeah. If you're moving one of the best centers in the game that easily, you are really that much of a beast. McAdoo. I'm not done scoring with Bob just yet. Great defense. See, now I'm actually contesting his jump shot, so that's why they're missing. Oh, McAdoo's open. He forgot to pick up McAdoo. Three points away from a 70-point game. We're at 69 points with McAdoo, and that's a tough shot. Okay, right here, we can score 71 with McAdoo. The lane's wide open. Oh, I got him jumping again. 71 points with McAdoo. This guy is amazing. If we go really crazy, we could possibly hit 80 points right here. Oh, wow. He's intentionally fouling. I think he wants me to get to 80 points too. All we need is nine more, and he's not going to miss any of these free throws. These are easy. Yeah, he's giving up. All we need, five more points. The door is wide open for McAdoo to hit 80 points. I'm going all the way. Okay, let's go. Two more free throws with McAdoo, and I missed one earlier. I'm not going to miss again. I just don't understand why he wants to foul. He must really want to get me to 80 points. We're four points away from 81. We could possibly tie Kobe's record. First free throw is good, and we're not going to miss the second. I love his quick release. 79 we have the chance to tie Kobe's 81 points with Bob McAdoo who would have thought that Bob McAdoo would ever score 80 points he's not helping in the paint this should be easy 81 points for McAdoo I need you guys to comment Kobe Bryant and this guy doesn't suck either he plays the game a lot he has that diamond Weber he has Matumbo this guy is no slouch one more bucket? Okay. Oh, how did he miss that layup? Antoine Walker might be the worst defender he has, and I missed that layup. Oh, and now he's quitting the game. So now I can't look at the stats after. Either way, y'all saw it. 81 points with Pink Diamond Bob McAdoo. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment Kobe Bryant for a chance at a shout out, and yeah, I'll be seeing you guys again real soon. Peace.